All right, yeah, so this is kind of, yeah, I'm making the moves for the Ninth Army and whatnot, and um, these guys right here, these one strength point dudes, I want to bring on over towards Lublin here as quickly as possible so I can get them recombined. They're called the, I'm not even going to try to pronounce them, so I'll just show them over here. That's what they are, and they're from the, originally from the 1st Brigade of the 1st Guards Infantry Division, um, Anyways, yeah, they're from that divisional breakdown thing, and I'm doing it my way, as you know. Anyways, I want to get them over here as quickly as possible. Yeah, as you know, it takes a long time, uh, or maybe, yeah, I'm just going to assume that you've been watching these videos. So, yeah, as you know, it takes a long time to uh, um, recombine, to get these guys up to full strength. I have to get them there. Uh, they can't move for a full turn, neither can the headquarters, so that means I got to get them there for one turn can't do anything the second turn then the third turn there you know can start doing something unfortunately i cannot get them to here in one turn i could rail them there in one turn however i've already used this bit of the rail line here i checked when i was sending reinforcements here there and everywhere and the replacement units i had to maximize um the use of the single track rail anyways that's been taken so i can't send uh those guys over there so i was like okay i can i'll just reassign them to the second army but i don't want to go down this road i don't like that um so what i'm doing is in my world and it was start it was something i was thinking about way back when when um i was starting to try to figure out um how each country was going to be organized when I wanted to do the grand campaign and, you know, uh, maybe go off into deviant land or whatever. Anyway, so what I'm doing is uh, these guys cannot be reassigned to um, Second Army due to the fact that um, they are assigned to the Ninth Army. That's an Army uh, commander. That's an Army commander. You need a sector commander to receive the, in, uh, in, um, hey, can we do this? And he'll come back and, or she'll come back and say yay or nay. So I wanted to have it, um, there's got to be a line of communication to the sector commander. Where is the sector commander located? These are things that I want to do anyway. So rather than this, you know, you just do it whenever you, the heck you want. So... Right now, I'm just going to use it uh, in this world, since I don't have a sector commander or any of that stuff. It's going to be uh, as soon as they can become adjacent to a core HQ or or something like that, then they can receive in, uh, instructions. Even if it's not a core HQ that's assigned to there, it's still kind of like this official whatever, rather than just some kind of crazy phone call or something or a pigeon showing up out of nowhere. That's the way I'm going to do it anyway, so... There we go.